What led me into the inclusion space really was I've always been quite different to, to people <laughs> that were at school with me and, and you know various other people that, that I know and really for me it was about giving back to, to other people within Virgin and, and the communities wider. My name is Victoria Whitehouse and I'm the inclusion lead at Virgin Media. I started my Virgin career back in 1997, working at Virgin Megastore. Then I got excited about the fact that Virgin Trains had started up. I didn't realise that was going to take me 19 years to end my career at Trains. I then moved across two months ago to Virgin Media as their inclusion lead and I'm super excited to be part of that team now. I believe that the uniqueness of the Virgin brand is the ethos that we can change things. Any market that Virgin goes into, it disrupts that market and really challenges the status quo. You know, I've, I've been here for 22 years in different various companies with Virgin, but I definitely wouldn't change it for the world. But one of my earliest memories is my, my nan bought me the Culture Club albums and I used to sit for hours in front of the record player watching the Virgin logo going round and round and round and I'm convinced it, it kind of hypnotised me to want to work for Virgin. The most exciting thing I got to do was wrap a train in pride colours. <laughs> I think it's not every day you get the opportunity to, to go and do something like that. I'd like to look back in 10 to 20 years and say that, you know, we've really had a massive impact, not just from a business perspective, but from a social demographic as well. The advice I give to anybody that, that's younger than me, which is not difficult these days, now I've turned big 4-0, uh, is if you're interested in coming and working for Virgin or in particular looking at working in the inclusion diversity space, talk to people, gain lived experience from people, ask them how they feel. For me, it's it's a special place, it's somewhere where I feel at home and I don't feel I have to pretend to be anyone else working for Virgin. By the time I retire, I'm hoping we have achieved a sense of everybody understanding that difference is good rather than it being a blocker to everything. Let's embrace it, let's, let's figure out how we all work together.